Hey, what's happening everybody? Hope you guys are feeling great. I'm Team Kills. What I like to do is make gaming easier. And welcome to another Kuva Compare. Now this is going to be the Kuva Karat. And this might not be fair. It's 2 on 1. Let's see how this turns out. Now, the original Karat, it's awesome. At mastery rank one to five, maybe, it's 100% gonna be one of the first automatic guns you will or should get in your very, very long Warframe journey. Now, it's really easy to get. You just gotta go to the store, buy it, build it 24 hours later, you can go on your first killing spree. It's fantastic. But because it's a first tier weapon, it, lacks in damage you move on or you might have just missed it in the first place altogether then the correct race shows up now this one you get through the invasions it's a little bit harder to get your hands on a little bit better to use and when you check the comparisons it's clearly better than the original correct but being a earlier weapon still second tier maybe weapons like the super vandal tiburon prime start to leave it in the dust so now the Karak is back one more time, the Kuva Karak, and it's actually really, really good, like dangerously good, like not the absolute best, but definitely not mastery fodder. Now you can see the improvements here. It's a dually, that's status or crit, your choice, but you kind of have to choose. If you try to split it down the middle, which you can, it will work, but you will technically be robbing yourself from this gun's max benefits. Now, I personally, I had to make a quick video on this solely because the Karak, it was my first automatic weapon. Well, basically my first weapon, I started with the Paris Prime, but I very, very quickly made the Karak. That one sucked, but it's a nostalgic thing. Anyways, anyways, enough of that crap. This gun shreds, especially when you put it in Mirage or Mesa's hands, like, oh, it's dangerous. 70 bullets in the barrel, high crit, high status. The only real drawback you have is the five form thing. Like, all Kuva weapons take five formas. Sucks. But, at least you'll be able to fit anything you want in it, and, here are some anything builds. Here's your basic power build. Uh, power, I like to kill things, and this gets the job done. This is my status build. It's nice, especially if you're going for a magnetic or viral toxin, whatever your effect, personal favorite effect is. It works. But personally, my favorite effect is the crit gun. The critical damage effect is Deaths. That's the status effect. So when I have to choose between confused, poison, or dead enemies, I usually choose dead enemies. That's it's just me, my personal preference. But anyways, I just wanted to say the Karak is back. The Kuva Karak is easily the best out of this Kuva compare. So it beats the two on one. I told you it wasn't going to be fair. But anyways, I do got more Kuva compares coming out. They're um, or they're already out, depending on when you see this. <laughs> but uh they're actually real comparisons not just smash fest like they've usually been turning out to be actually it's a lot fairer than you might think you might be surprised you might not want to miss that one so join the team of killers become a killer of teams and let me know what you're thinking in the comments and instagram these are the ways we could talk if you hang out to the end i really really appreciate that you can leave the word nostalgia in the comments if you're new to the team so we know who you are. Make sure to keep it easy and remember, just keep gaming.